Hello, you demi. I'm Shahzad Ahmed from Shakespeare.com, and welcome in lecture number seventeen. Uh, so, you have created the edit system. So here is one thing: if your admin or you want to update this image, for suppose you have just created the edit system and you are just editing the field only, but what happens if you want to update the image so how can you create uh, how can you manage uh, these talks uh, if you are going to update image also with your fields so first of all go to your edit category view make sure you have to create another hidden field and you uh, we are saying this is the dp so now we are sending id and your image in the hidden fields so now i am saying old image old image okay so you are sending from the html so now you have to receive this at the back end so now this is the old image you are receiving the old image now you can see this is the old image first of all now second what you need to check you need to check either your admin is passing an image or not so how can you do that i am saying uh, create a if statement for suppose i am saying create a if statement and i am checking and i am saying image checking here okay image checking here so how can you check your image i am saying if the is set what files which files i am saying this file if this file is is set and i'm saying and is uploaded file so this is the method and i'm saying file first of all then i'm saying tmp sorry tmp and i'm saying name that means you are checking that if the image is required means someone sending the image or not if someone sending the image from the html that means it's true so what you need you need to accept that image so how can you do that i am saying that copy this bad boy and paste this bad boy here because this is the same code okay i am saying what happens i am saying this is the image path i am configuring a uh, size allowed types loading the library and i am checking if we we are going uh, uh, we have successfully uploaded image or not so i am saying if the image is not uploaded so where you can send the error message i'm saying send the error message to all categories first suppose okay otherwise we are not okay if you have uploaded the image or if you are sending the image from the database uh, of course uh, we are about to send it but for now we are receiving the image saving on the data field but it happens whenever you want to check the image is coming from the html or not so first of all added this section and now i am saying edit again so hit the update button so you can see you have successfully edited 
again this failed so now you can update you can also update this image so how can you do that I am saying in this time I am going to now update this image okay so now I am saying update so now you can see you have successfully updated your image now so go to your directory open your e drive and check the images you have uploaded so now in the images sections you have categories so now you can see you have your new image but what about your old image you must delete your old image before updating it so how can you delete your old image I'm saying so you are receiving the old image name first of all then I'm saying just before after update the image just check the image path so how can you check your image path I'm saying first of all check if this is empty means this is not empty and I'm saying if this is not empty and this is also is set means uh, your admin is updating the image then what you need to check you need to check uh, either your file is exist or not I'm saying file exist and what you what you need to provide you need to provide the path because <laughs> this is the path make sure provide the absolute path so this is the path and old image so what is the image name so this is your old image name so path and image name if this path is exist I'm saying just unlike what unlike I'm saying remove this image okay refresh this page so now you can see you have your image I'm going to upload another image uh, which is uh, this image and now update the category the file you are attempting okay this is uh, the huge image I'm saying now I'm going to select a little image so where is the little image I'm saying so I'm going to I'm going to download some images okay image image so now I'm going to pass this image which you have just downloaded sorry all categories you have this image now change the image update the category now you can see you have updated but go to your folder and now check you have successfully deleted your old image from the folder too and you have successfully updated your new images images so uh, it's totally depend upon you and it's totally depend upon your systems how you are going to create your system or how you are creating your system and what are the requirements of your systems uh, so think out of the box because it's required to delete your old images for suppose you have a 1 GB uh, because you have if you are working uh, on a server or if you have a shared hosting then you have a limited resources so that's why you need to delete all of your old images so I think this is enough for today so thank you for watching